And Ashoff back with us. Let's get educated on some college football coaching news. And there's a lot of it to discuss. Two high-profile jobs prompting a lot of speculation, UCLA and Florida. Let's start with the Bruins. What's going on there? Well, after firing Jim Mora, Chip Kelly's name was the biggest one on the list. And it's obvious that he's become the number one target for UCLA. Uh, with him meeting with Florida last week, he quickly met with UCLA on Tuesday. And the confidence in the Florida side has gone down a little bit. And they think that, you know, they've got to reach out to other candidates as well. But it seems like Chip Kelly is number one on UCLA's list. We'll see what happens here in the next couple of days. All right, so if they don't get Kelly, Scott Frost is right down the road at UCF. I mean, he downplayed any talk of moving on, saying he's focused on UCF right now. But how much is he in the mix at Florida? Yeah, he's definitely in the mix. When you have the number one scoring offense in the country and Florida has needed scoring the last few years, he's going to be there. Plus, he's really close to Gainesville. But the issue with Florida here is if Scott Frost is really comfortable being in Orlando. I've talked to people at UCF who say that he loves living there. He loves the commitment of the program at UCF. So if Scott Frost weren't to work out, Florida still has options. You have Dan Mullen at Mississippi State, maybe a Charlie Strong at South Florida. Dana Holgerson at West, uh, West Virginia and even Mike Leach at Washington State could be on the table for the Gators.